Boom, fewer subscribers. But I could get my this quick updates because trust, if it's not foreign from King Mix Up, it's not credible. Lally. First thing, Lali, you come in with this big fucker in a Lali. You have fucker man, you know. You come in with big, this big fucker boy. Conflicts and body bomb clad. Lali, listen to me. Lali, you turn on the blood clad carrier. I'm coming on with a groan this one. You hear my head feel mad. I'm going to beat a shot at JB. Lali, listen to me. Cut your fuck you out, Lali. You're a black motherfucker. Cut your fuck you out, dark like Africa. You hear me I tell you? I stop it like a, a body bomb buck like boy, Lali. Be a wine, me see you wine up, brother. You know no girl, you, your girl stop wine. You know no girl a wine. You know have no girl for wine. You know have no woman. Eh? You know have no bomb buck like woman. You don't know some woman for wine and roll belly. And twerk and shake and ass all of them bum buckle or something there, brother. You don't know so that's a woman thing. And what you do? You see Bogle and come out and shake no ass? You see Waki and come out and shake no ass? You see no dance on a bus back? No dance on the call life dance some come out and shake no bum buckle at ass, boy, yeah, brother. And not throw no belly skin, boy, that, boy this bum buckle at ya. I'm not fuck up man tradition, I'm not fuck up man culture, I'm not pass here and tell you them. I pay you to miss you, I dance so. I'm not show belly so. I talk about dirt. What the fuck is that? Telling you they go play ring a ring a rose, you and, and they sit there with the blood clad girl, they must stop separate them. And stop making it like it's a Batman sport. I want to add the boy here. Yeah. Lolly. I don't like bun artists in the lolly, I don't like this, I don't like what I have to do it. But nobody is not telling me, bum buckle or chode. And I feel like, I still not put it on promotion. Next thing, when I go start the whole thing, I'm not going to make it in a fucking room. And I talk about that. Then if I wind up, and I laugh up and I enjoy. No fuck, I'm not going to fuck next time I enjoy. I feel it is alright. Phone down, bum buckle or move when I talk. Eh? No, that's what I'm going to do next. Cut the fuck you out, lolly. Cut your fuck you out and sing some good music. Don't bother sing about no conflicts and no body, no bumble club, body water. And none of them fuck you the way you sing you. Cause we don't have a platform to sing for people here and carry on music. Hey you, listen to me man. You listen to me now you. We don't have one blood clot pit here and look at you. Cause we don't run put, we don't run put some bad bum, we don't run put some bad bumble club man. But we don't know what you do. I don't grow up man you pan you. What kind of dirt? First thing, what kind of name is that? That's not even a name, brother. The concept of dirt of your bury things and kill things. I have you, man, I do it. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that, Lali? And let me see you now put it on be a promotion on the top about dirt. Dirt, dog, you know what? Some man holding and going to some liquid, some blood clot. Big up yourself, Ice Cool, yo. Uh, no, we don't know what they're putting at a KFC chicken, you know? But yes, people, I think this is the video in question he's talking about, you know, a lot of African males in Jamaica is, you know, twerking. You feel what I'm saying? And it's a big deal because of how they're trying to portray African men nowadays. Look at little Nas S, you know what I mean? And I see a lot of people saying, you know, we don't know our African traditions and all of these things. You ever see these people talk about their African traditions? So it has nothing to do with African traditions. I think they're trying to compete with the the woman them for go viral and all of these things, you know. If you're not practicing African traditions, since on a call it, what's the name of that tradition, you know? These people don't practice nothing African. The only time man for post the wine, I uh, when them in a some panani, you feel what I'm saying? Yes, so let's proceed with the next updates. Oh, and big up on yourself, people. I'm just giving you all the tea because I have to deal with some things, you know. Go up on the road and thing and thing. Oh, and who is the originator for this dance? Because uh, I think Coolio said, I saw some youth from Portmore uh, and, and, and them hijacked you know. Mm. Now, the Jamaican white yardie is embroiled in some... I wouldn't say beef, but, you know, he and some food company, I think Tropical Sun, and we'll get the name right, um, is going at it on Instagram, you know, uh, White Yardy is saying, you know, what does this company do to benefit Jamaica and things and things and, you know, 
the people them, you know, respond and this him up and him father and all these things. So let us listen to what he has to say, then we'll get into what um the the, the food company is saying to him, you know. So I thought my mind real fast about the situation right here, yeah. So this is another one of them situations where people are use the Jamaican culture for better for themselves and don't, and them don't have nothing to do with Jamaica. You understand what I mean? These man here yeah, had the brand called Tropical Sun. If you're from, if you're from the UK, you will know about Tropical Sun. It's a brand where they make of seasonings and all different type of products which Caribbean people them use. Yeah, and them you them put them in areas to target. The black community, the Caribbean community, yeah, by branding themselves as a Caribbean brand. They got caught out and people find out, say, yo, them are not Caribbean. Them are not Caribbean. Them are not for the Caribbean, but them are use it. So people them start boycott them. Now, as you can see from what is written here, they have been feeling it over the years. In the, them pocket are dry up. Them not sell as much because now people realize and say, oh, them, them people are, are some fake people, them. Them are try trick with. You don't know. Big up Jamaica Valley. Real authentic brand. Made by Jamaicans in Jamaica. Shipped around the world. Real seasoning. You are get real products. And that's why me promote Jamaica Valley. Because a proper thing them are deal with. Yeah? Not them people. Yeah. Now, what them are try to do? They feel like they can trick people. Them are going to rebrand. They want to rebrand the whole thing. And come with things like, oh, jam true Jamaican. How you are true Jamaican? Which part? Eh? Which part are you are true Jamaican? Or how you come rebrand and come call yourself true Jamaican? And Jamaican pride and no bother with it. No, I'm not saying you can make your season in them. Make your season in them. But you don't have to try brand it to make it appeal because you're not from there. You understand what I mean? Like make your season in them. Put out your product. If people want to buy it, then buy it. You understand? You have whole heap of seasoning out there where people buy when I have nothing to do with Jamaican. And Jamaican and Caribbean people will go buy it. But even though it's not a Jamaican or, or Caribbean brand, them still go buy it because they don't say, yo, you know that seasoning? I like that seasoning, you know. But they try it one time and never. I like it. Stick to it, yeah? Stick to that. You not have to brand your thing and I try, try up, make it look like, oh, look at me. We are, you, no. And some people might come and talk about, or oh, some people might come and talk about, oh, yadi. But they could say that about you because you use the Jamaican culture and, and for build your career. No. Yeah. At the age of three months, me got introduced. Three months. Me no know nothing. Me no even know world. I don't know nothing. I, at the age of three months, you no know nothing more than titty and milk. Yeah. Titty and milk, you know. Titty and milk are the only thing you know at three months, three months old. Yeah. Me no know nothing. I'm a growing at the culture from three months old till now. Yeah, me growing at that the culture there. Black River Saint Elizabeth. Me go primary, me go before primary school. Me go, me go Saint Teresa. Yeah, which is was 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 the school we run by nuns. Anybody from Black River will know me at all. But then me go primary school. Then me go high school. Yeah, all of Jamaica. Yeah, and the culture they me growing at. So I'm my culture, the culture will grow me. If me never dip on social media, if me never be a stand up comedian, this would still be who I am. Yeah, so me no use no culture. Yeah, me embrace the culture when me growing up. Yeah, and that's why me wave the flag proud anywhere me going at the world. Yeah, and when me see things like this, me call them out. When me see things like this, me call them out. People need to know, we need to expose them. A whole heap of them are use the Caribbean culture and them not give back to the Caribbean culture. They not do nothing for the culture, they not do nothing for the people. Them, yeah, wake up, people. Yeah, just to make you know. This is not a Jamaican or a Caribbean brand. So when you see it, walk past it. We're going to come. You yeah, am tell you why it's a fit, uh, and a fit, and a, and a Caribbean. Where them uh, uh, belongs to Tropical Sun. Tropical Vibes. A liquid drink them where everybody love. Yeah. Yeah. It's Tropical Vibes is nothing to do with the Caribbean. But them brand it and, uh, uh, and make it appeal to Caribbean people. Wake up. You understand? You can't trick me. I'm out. And again, these allegations where you already put forth towards tropical sun foods are allegations, yes. And they said they are false, so we're just putting that out there. But they responded to that video saying, Hi, right, you already, if your interest is truly in spreading the truth, 
for protecting Jamaica from being exploited, would it not have been co- appropriate to speak to us first and get our perspective before putting this video out? There is a lot you got wrong here and a lot of important information omitted. I'll give you two examples. The first is that some of the products you personally endorse are not made in Jamaica despite the claims on the packaging. Have you ever taken the time to check the authenticity of the products you endorse? The companies might be owned or partially owned by Jamaicans, but the products are not always made in Jamaica. The second is that the tropical sun does support the Jamaican community, both in the Caribbean and the UK. We have actually a long history of it, and details are not hard to find. They're on our website. It's community page for one. If you like to have a proper conversation, we are open to it. If you actually care about the truth, then DM us. Let's talk and you can see how you you will feel at the end of the conversation and the white you already said at tropical sun foods is your product made in jamaica by jamaicans with jamaican ingredients and the company i promote has their ingredients shipped from jamaica and i think this is the one that pissed off the tropical sun foods white yardy asks are you jamaican owned in parentheses black owned and i think that's the question most want to know and they responded and said no white yardy we are not jamaican owned we've never once claimed to be we do however work with more jamaican owned suppliers than likely any other food brand we've been supporting jamaican farmers and businesses before your dna left your daddy's nutsack all you had to do was (laughs) no 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 not the daddy not the daddy White Yardy responds, RP, my dad, great man, go to St. Elizabeth, Black River, you were here. Oh, loved he was for everything he done, not her done. Real boss, IRP done. And you know, they responded, our point here is that we've been working with Jamaican businesses for many years since before you were born. You've made fake accusations of us and point and published photos of our founders casually, but no disrespect intended. And we certainly respect your love for Jamaica. And you know, them said you can delete the comments and delete my account and all these things. But some people are saying, why you already have uh, sponsorship with the next food company so maybe that's why am i you know but me just uh, spread the message you know what you think about the situation between white yardy and this uh company um using jamaica the profit you know cha 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 anyway people just giving them quick updates on ice cool you and this so don't forget to hit the like button subscribe and notification Bell because I run and say get the latest in a dance on news, music reviews and gossips. Blessed.